Thanks for staying with us here on TVC News. In Taraba State, the Victims Support Fund has donated food and non-food items to victims of communal crisis. The VSF chairman also laid the foundation for the construction of a block of three classrooms, toilets, a healthcare dispensary, and a rice factory in the community. Ola Biadinusi reports on this. The agrarian community of Yakwala was one of the worst hit by the escalated land dispute crisis between the Chief Jokun in Wokari local government area. The crisis which erupted between Jukun Chief in Benue State resulted into the death of 14 persons with property worth millions of naira destroyed in Yakwala community. The livelihood of thousands were affected, prompting the district health of the community and other stakeholders to seek the help of General T. Y. Danjuma. Their requests have been granted through the intervention of the Victim Support Fund, one Danjuma charity organization. Some community leaders speak on how devastating the conflict was. We don't know what happened just in the night, on the 19th of April, then we started hearing shooting guns everywhere around the corner. We called, we called security men. They, should, they could not come to our rescue. Philip Aboki are the ones who wrote the letter to General T.Y. Danjuma requesting support for the people of Yakwala after the Boko Haram invasion and the violent crisis that greeted this community in 2014. Some victims expressed a fear that they may not benefit to be captured in the gesture. But their fears were laid by address of the advisor administration of the VSF. Mrs. Toyo Seokunjimi assured all the 10,000 registered victims that they will get what contained in the card issued to them. If anybody has a victim support fund card, then they will get something. This was a flag off ceremony. The distribution will follow the flag off. Governor Dara Sishako, who was represented by the Commissioner for Humanitarian Service, disclosed that the state has put mechanism on ground to ensure the crisis does not repeat itself in the future. It commended the foundation for the gesture. My ministry and other relevant ministries in the state government will have to come and look at what is happening here. We have to make sure that we come from time to time to supervise and to ensure that they are not detracting from the purpose for which these things have been set up here. The VSF has raised hope in the community by installing a solar power borehole and giving 150,000 naira to each beneficiary with further promise to provide an ambulance vehicle, among others, for the community.